Hi there, today I want to show you a tool that we've been using in our department, or at least half our department's been using it, and we're going to try and convince the other half to use it. So um, I'm going to take you on a little tour of this tool called Slack. Basically, Slack is a chat room, and it allows you to have any number of chat rooms within this chat space. So we have these channels, I guess you could call them, uh, very IRC um, reminiscent, um, and We've uh, separated them out into um, very specific educational technology, a general one, and some random stuff for just for fun. So the EdTech one, we have these conversations. Uh, the most recent conversation is actually about the tool itself, where Matt has done some IFTT integrations, um, and I was uh, <laughs> saying I didn't like it. And so we were just having a conversation that's in there. But the thing that I really like about it is although our offices are actually all on the same floor, what I used to do when I needed, um, when I had a question or I needed something from one of the guys is I would get up and walk over and I would interrupt them and I would make them stop what they were doing and answer my question immediately by imposing myself on them. And it wasn't quite important enough to um, warrant an email. I find email is kind of like a formal thing that if I need to include my supervisor or um, or other departments, then I would definitely send, use an email, but this is just something I was like, can you just clarify something for me, or how does this work, and why isn't this going this way, or what happened here, then um, we can actually put those into this room, um, and then everybody can see it, it's, it's visible, and that somebody can answer it when they want. Uh, you can see that people can tag somebody specifically, but it's all visible for everybody else to see. Of course, there are private messages as well, um, like, for example, I had a meeting and my appointment had showed up, so Mike sent me a private message to say, hey, your one o'clock is here, but if you wanted to do it that way, you could. Um, and uh, the random is very fun. It's a place for, I really feel like this is a, a place for us to share really silly things that don't necessarily need to go out into the general uh, stream. So of course there's Twitter, which is a great tool, and I really do appreciate when people um, post their problems and solutions out in public and have really have public conversations but some of these things like um, did, did you do this um, you know questioning w some internal processes don't necessarily need to be aired out in the public I could see um, uh, you know the choice of tool being maybe more specific uh, being shared but uh, when it's just you know I see an email about this and why is it in in my inbox that could be clarified much simpler just through this tool. So it's a very uh, fun and um, I find it has actually helped workflow uh, for me specifically. Um, so I like it. I have it integrated into my phone so I get a little uh, notification if somebody uh, posts to it and yeah I think it's been very effective so far. There's probably more to it than, than that but that is all I use it for and I am quite pleased with it.